Hey everyone, I'm Kelsey with iFixit, and today I'm gonna to show you how to replace the display on your Samsung Galaxy S9 Plus. For this repair, you're going to need an eye opener, a suction handle, iFixit opening picks, a spudger, a Phillips 00 screwdriver, isopropyl alcohol, a heat gun, and tweezers. We also recommend using a magnetic mat for this repair. It'll keep your screws organized and safe from rolling away. Our repair procedure uses a replacement display without a frame, meaning you get to change out the display without having to remove everything else in your phone. So this is not the procedure you should use if you're trying to replace both the display and the frame. Start by making sure that your phone is off and use your eye opener to heat up the back panel to soften the adhesive and repeat if necessary. If the adhesive continue to give you a hard time, try using the heat gun or a hair dryer. Lay your suction cup on the phone as close to the heated edge as possible. Then use your pick to cut away the adhesive all around the edges. Once you have a portion of the panel separated, insert a pick to keep the adhesive from resealing. Work your pick around the phone, cutting all the adhesive, but be careful. Don't slide the pick in too far or else you might damage the fingerprint sensor. Once you have all the adhesive cut, lift the panel and disconnect the fingerprint sensor. On the mid-frame, you have 11 Phillips 00 screws that hold the NFC antenna and the wireless charging coil. Once you've removed these screws and components, go ahead and disconnect the battery. Then go ahead and disconnect the display cable as well. The display is held by copious amounts of adhesive, so we need our eye opener to soften it. Place your suction cup on the heated edge, and when you have a gap, use your pick to slowly move around the edge of the display. Use a couple drops of isopropyl alcohol to help soften the adhesive. Careful going around the right side where the display cable is hiding. You don't want to cut it. If you ever feel that the adhesive is still too hard, try using a heat gun as well. With all the adhesive free, you can remove the display from the midframe. That's all for this repair. Be sure to hit subscribe so you have our next repair videos in your back pocket for your next fix. I'll see you next time.